Michael Anderson Elementary School at Fairchild Air Force Base donated the use of their gym to the Treats to Troops campaign. This campaign was made possible by Creme 2, a local Spokane news station, and the Red Cross, as well as several community partners. Collection boxes were staged around the city for donations. Treats to Troops' mission is to collect gifts and sweets from the local community to give to airmen that are apart from their loved ones during the holidays. We had so many donations that we were able to fill plenty of boxes to go downrange and then there were so many uh, extra donations we, we filled I would say about a, a thousand grocery bags uh, that were donated by the commissary to uh, give to dorm residents on base. Volunteers from Team Fairchild with grocery bags in hand went to work filling bag after bag with goodies for their brothers and sisters in arms. Efforts like the Treats the Troops campaign give a piece of home to those whose homes are so far away. You know, it takes sometimes a small army to do and move all this stuff, so it actually helps out a lot when everybody volunteers. After a long morning, the bags were collected and delivered to airmen living in the dorms at Team Fairchild. This is just one of the many ways Fairchild and the city of Spokane show support for its veterans. Reporting from Fairchild Air Force Base, I'm Staff Sergeant DJ Ayers.